everybody, this is the Alternative BBC, this is Gwen O'David and I am the Bathroom Broadcasting Coach. Well, I've been doing these now for a week and to celebrate that fact, I put on a sparkly top for you. Yes, there you go. Uh, today is the 30th of March and it is session 8. Today we're going to be looking at life's purpose. Yesterday we looked at happiness and some of the things that can make us happy and the thing that I actually suggested was that it was to do with service to others. Helping other people makes me really happy and making other people happy makes me delirious. So, um, but the big question that we have to ask ourselves about your life purpose is really, why am I here? Why am I doing what I'm doing? Now, I'm gonna ask myself this question about my coaching and I will give you a response which is basically, I've done it forever. I started, I suppose, when I was a kid. I was a kid in Fishguard School in West Wales, and I loved athletics. And I used to take children up uh, from about year two or three, or secondary uh, school, and I used to train them and coach them up on the playing fields there in preparation for county sports, etc. Athletics and cross country were my delight, and I used to organise clubs, and I ended up also being the Spartan house captain. So this issue of motivating and uh, cajoling people to do things is second nature to me. I have literally been doing it all my life. And I actually love enabling other people to do things. So that's one of the purposes I have in my life. I have many purposes. I am part of a very large family. And one of my purposes is to make sure that uh, my mother and my daughter, for example, are happy, content and uh, enabled in this period of time, which is immensely challenging. Now, we all have a purpose. We may not see it, we may not feel it, but we all have a part to play in this big world. You will notice that the people who are coming to the forefront in this COVID crisis are not the millionaires, the ones with the Ferraris, they're no good to you when you're at home and you're stuck in your bathroom broadcasting to the nation. The ones who are actually really making a difference are the people who are enabling others. Enabling others to live a healthy life, enabling others to eat, enabling others to have good, good health. So this is what can be your purpose. And I think what's happened in this COVID crisis is that we actually start to realise that we all have a part to play, whatever the part is. Now, I have no idea if anybody is watching this, but it has given me a purpose to get up every day, put my clothes on and make sure that I have prepared for this afternoon's broadcast. I hope it helps other people as well, because otherwise uh, it's just me and four walls, really. So I'm thinking of doing a similar thing through the medium Welsh. I've had a few requests, but I'm going to be doing that from the comfort of my bed. Isn't that glorious? So um, if you are interested in uh, seeing a Welsh version of this, then let me know through Facebook. Uh, I'm just going to remind you again, if you want to have a one-to-one -one session, I am available and I am now can work through Zoom. Yes, this is what I've challenged myself to do over the last week and I can do it. So I can work by Zoom throughout the world. Uh, I could work with Skype before, but now I can work with Zoom. Um, I also have a whole load of uh, information that I'm sharing on my group on Facebook, which is called uh, Gwen O'David Leadership and Public Speaking Coach. And if you want to get in touch with me, see some testimonials. I've just finished working with a young girl up in North Wales um, via, uh, actually, we just did Facebook, I think. Um, we were sending videos back and forth and the transformation is fabulous. So thank you, Poppy, for giving me such a lovely testimonial and good luck in your audition very soon. So again, just get out there, do your bit and keep your chin up. Okay, ta-da!